Yo, quick video. I don't want to make this last too long, but I want to talk about the Black Misandry in the Black Panther movie. Now, I, I personally don't think that King T'Challa is a good character. I don't think he um is good representation for a black character, at least in his own movie. Black Panther was so much better during the um, Captain America Civil War. He had a strong presence in the movie. I mean, he was dominant. He had good character development in the movie. He was a badass in the movie as well. And he was, you can feel the masculinity that he carried with the character. And you couldn't really not mention Black Panther without talking uh, if you talked about the movie you couldn't talk about it without mentioning Black Panther at some point because he had that much of a strong impact in the movie now fast forward to Black Panther the movie it was like his character downgraded it was like his presence wasn't as strong as it was in Civil War this is in Black Panther's own movie though. And it's kind of like the move it's like the energy of the movie. It was more matriarchal than patriarchal. I mean, it's supposed to be about King Chitala and the men, right? But it seemed like the women in the movie was doing all the heavy lifting. And it seemed like it was mainly about the women. You got Black Panther's sister making his suit and stuff, right? Why does um, King Chitala need his sister to operate the suit, make the suit, when King T'Challa is like a smart guy? He's one of the smartest characters in the Marvel Universe, by the way. He up there, honestly, he up there with Tony Stark and um, Mr. Fantastic. He at least rivals them, so he should have been able to do all that stuff on his own. And then at the end of the movie, it was kind of like a civil war between a lot of the men and the women because a lot of people was on Killmonger's side of trying to take over the world globally. And most of the people was on King Jatala's side was the women. And then and then the women managed to beat the men on the movie. I'm like, come on, man, really? I just noticed that Black Panther at his best was was actually done by a white man. I think a white guy was on um, the writer of of Captain America Civil War. It, it's funny how Black Panther at his best it was when he was written by a white writer and then Black Panther at his worst was at his worst when he was written by a black dude and i can tell that the um the brother who's basically like the writer and everything on the black path of the movie he he's matriarchal or or a simp but as a um black panther 2 hopefully is a lot better than the first one but this is it this is all i want to say it, this is just something i wanted to point out because I noticed this and I'm out.